Hello and welcome to History Pod. On the 15th of July 1834, the Tribunal of the Holy Office of the Inquisition, otherwise known as the Spanish Inquisition, was disbanded. Originally established in 1478 by the Catholic monarchs, the Spanish Inquisition came under the direct control of the Spanish monarchy rather than the church, which meant that it was used as both a religious and political organisation. By the time it was abolished, up to 150,000 people had been tried by the Spanish Inquisition, of whom somewhere between two and 5,000 were executed. The Spanish Inquisition's main task was to regulate and maintain Catholic orthodoxy within the dual kingdoms of Aragon and Castile. Their main focus was actually on Jews who outwardly converted to Christianity but continued to practice Judaism. Known as crypto-Jews, this group was disproportionately targeted by the Inquisition especially after Ferdinand and Isabella ordered all Jews and Muslims to convert to Catholicism or to leave the country in decrees that they issued in 1492 and 1501. The British historian Henry Cayman estimates that up to 90% of Inquisition trials were for crypto-Jews. The Enlightenment had a significant impact on the activities of the Spanish Inquisition, as the government gradually became more secular. The fact that many of the Enlightenment texts were being brought into Spain by influential nobles meant that the ideas that would previously have been policed by the Inquisition had to be increasingly tolerated. Although the Inquisition made a short comeback after Napoleon Bonaparte's older brother Joseph dissolved it during his short time as king, the Inquisition was finally abolished by Maria Cristina of the Two Sicilies. <laughs>